Okay, let's try again. I filmed it the first time and then realized that my screen was frozen on my computer, uh, so it didn't record right. So, here we go. Let's try again. Like I said, guys, if you guys are new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And if you're just watching right now, make sure you guys hit that like button. Definitely greatly appreciate it. Uh, you guys want me to keep doing more of these. The last time I've done this was probably a couple months ago. Normally, I do it every month or so, but I've kind of been busy with a bunch of stuff. So, I'm kind of... Kind of got pushed back a little bit, but there wasn't really much now anyway. Every couple months is probably a good idea for it, but now we're about to get hit, hit season 10 in a couple of hours, so I'm going to show you all the skins I have from season 2 all the way up to season 9. So here we go. Right now, you can see Breakpoint is my new favorite go-to at this moment. I love this skin. This is what I use most uh, at anything right now, so my go-to favorite. Here we go, Blackheart, cool one. This was uh, a couple of seasons ago, Battle Pass tier 100. Uh, pretty cool, different styles. Run through them real quick for you guys. Yeah, but pretty cool. This is gonna kind of be a long video just to warn you guys. Um, I have a lot of stuff and it's been, since it's been so long, a lot of stuff to explain. And stuff you'll see in season 10 will, won't be out for probably till maybe end of season 10, so probably won't be till November. Probably next time I'll do a locker video so we'll see if i buy any skins or get skins from the battle pass which i definitely plan on getting in the morning here so yeah we got a couple hours left until next season here is this is one, one of the tier 100 skins from a couple seasons ago uh i didn't start buying i didn't start buying the battle pass till season five sadly so i missed out on a lot of awesome skins but it is what it is i can't be mad about it oh i keep clicking on that real quick so i'm just showing you guys all the cool stuff I have in my, sh in my, um, my locker. Rumor has it that you might be able to mix some skins around, like, part of a skin. Like, you could have, like, the, the drift, um, head part of it and then have, like, the sculpture body. Those are just rumors. We'll find out in a couple hours if that is true or not. If you're going to add, you could really customize your skins. That'd be really, really cool. I really hope to do that. That would actually be really, really neat. But, they're just rumors. So, we'll find out, I guess, in a couple hours or not. Right now, we're filming at 11.33 p.m. and the update doesn't drop until 4 a.m. so we have a bunch of hours left so I'm gonna be up early for that so it'll be fun to be a fun day tomorrow this is probably I don't know I think I think this, I think this was one of the tier 100 skins was not not a fan of it not really one of the best skins I'm not something that I really use Bunker Jonesy is kind of cool I do have to get my overtime challenges done so I can unlock the the light teal blue variant of it but if I don't, I don't. I've been busy lately, so that's why some things haven't been unlocked yet. I'm trying to get the battle pass done, kind of falling behind on that, so that's my excuse. So hopefully you guys see some ones I don't have complete yet. You guys should see it by next time I do a locker update video. Uh, so I just unlocked this guy. So this is a tier 100 for season nine battle pass. So next time I do a locker update video, you guys should see the rest of it. Uh, so I have a little bit of ways to go on that. This is a cool one. This is one of my top five favorites. Um, we got this one during, um, before the, one of the events, on the prisoner skin. Uh, you had to unlock, you had to complete a bunch of battle pass challenges. So, and then you had to find the keys to unlock the different stages. Like I said, definitely one of my top, my top five favorites. Ice King's another cool one too. Definitely really like this skin. Chicken, I just, I don't know, I do like the skin a little bit, but I don't think I'll be using it too much actually in game. Just, I don't know, it looks cool, but not something I really would use in a game. This is a cool one, I have used the skin a lot. Actually, recently I've used it a lot. I still got a couple more things to unlock, but this is definitely one I'm going to be using uh, a lot, and I feel like in the future. This is another one, the Link's one I do too. Um, this is another really cool one. This is another one of my top, probably top 10 favorite skins I guess I got a couple more to unlock actually no I don't I have everything but yeah pretty cool I know I'm, I'm really tired so I'm like I'm losing my mind um but yeah it's the second time recording it and now I think I'm pretty sure I'm about to lose my voice but yeah like I said this is another skin I use a lot um this is another one of those um star pack skins like I said I, I love to collect a lot of star pack skins so you guys will see a bunch here um uh, I use this one occasionally too this is another cool one from the Bow Pass for the season, season 9. Uh, this is a couple of seasons ago, D DJ Yonder. 
this is what we wanted to start. I think it's what season seven. I don't exactly know. I get all my seasons confused, but it's like one of the, like the tier one skin when you just get it. Skins like this one and the next one I'll show you are different ones I used during Halloween. Uh, like I said, I used some skins I used just during the Halloween or different seasons like during winter, Halloween, just whatever St. Patrick's Day. So those are a couple ones. This is kind of a I hate to say it, this is kind of the dumbest skin. Uh, this is one of the battle pass skins. Uh, I would never use this during the game. You really, really stand out. Unless I'm fooling around. It's just not something I would definitely, definitely use. Definitely a, um, definitely a noob skin. And there are cool skin too, Viking skin. And there I wanted to start pack skins. This is actually the very first skin I've ever got. So, definitely use this one sometimes too. A little story back. Because I might, might use that tomorrow if we're going to go back in time. Um, so, you might be seeing me start streaming with this skin a little bit more. Just a little bit. Um, a little bit of a throwback. Another one of those Star Pack skins. This is a cool one too. Like I said, use this one during the winter time. Uh, definitely a cool skin too. We can see different variants. Only two, but a really cool skin. Oh, Peely. Peely is probably one, definitely one of my top five favorite skins. Oh, I, I know you stand out, um, but Peely is definitely one of my definitely one of my favorite skins. And definitely it changes colors. It ripens during the game, so it's very very cool. Onesie. Unfortunately, I unlocked the uh, during season seven. I unlocked the second variant of the skin, but oh well. This is why I use during Halloween time. Uh, pretty cool skin. This one's all right. Not really a big fan of it. It's all right. I guess the silver is kind of cool, but not not really a big fan of it. Marshmallow, not a cool one. This one came out during the event a couple seasons ago. Um, disappointed. It did come back out again for the World Cup, sadly. Uh, it's only going to be out for those. I think it came out only two times originally before. I think maybe no, three days. Before, during, after the after the event. But, oh well. They brought back. I don't get mad over skins. But, it's a bummer. Still a super, super cool skin. And hopefully they do like bring like famous people into the game in the future. So, this could be a beginning for it. This is another one I use during the winter time. Just kind of fit with seasonal. Uh, whatever the season is in the game. Or time of year, I should say. So, pretty cool. Like I guess I use this one during Halloween. Another cool one. Skull Trooper. God, say this is probably one of my top top five favorite skins. Easy. Sadly, I didn't start buying skins until... Well, I didn't, I didn't do the Battle Pass until Season 5. But I didn't start buying skins until I think late Season 3 or 4. So, I missed out on getting, being an OG. But hey, this is pretty cool. I'm happy to have it. And it's probably going to be out again. That and the, um, the Gold Trooper is probably going to be out coming this Halloween again for sure football skin pretty cool one this one came out during the NFL season and we got a couple different variants for the Super Bowl which they might wonder if they're going to add on more for the Super Bowl uh, so I guess we'll have to wait and see but this is definitely going to be out again uh, in the upcoming football season so it's be pretty cool this is another cool one I guess I'm not a big fan of it got some more unlocking to do which I'll probably do which you'll probably see um, during my next lock update video which is going to be at the end of Season 10. Which is going to be here. It's going to come and go before we know it. So that's going to be November. But this time just flies. I can't believe Season 9 is already over. But this one right here is another starter skin. Pretty cool. Battle Pass skin. Pretty cool. Rescue. Lifeguard skin. Star Pack skin. Pretty cool. Fortnite World Cup. I hope they have a different one they do next World Cup next year. I hope they have a different variant. So this, so this one ends up being a very, very rare skin. Uh, I think this is only out two or three times in a row during the weekend of the World Cup. Like I said, hopefully they have a different kind for next season or next year's um, World Cup. So this one could be real cool. This is part of the 2019 set. Um, so I assume they're going to have a different one for next year, 2020 World Cup if they do it. But this is going to be an ultra rare skin because this skin's never going to be out again. So that's really, really cool. This one's a cool, very cool skin I use occasionally. Like I said, this breakpoint is my go-to favorite skin right now. Use this one all the time. Just really cool how it looks. Now our starter pack skin, really cool, and then a couple more battle pass skins, and then I use this one during winter time, or when they had the loot lake, well not loot lake, um, poor peak events, I use this one a couple times during that, you guys probably have seen it, but some, some skins I used to use during the season, which I hope, like the rumor's been saying, that you can mix and match skins around, which would be really, really cool for season 10 if you do it, hopefully you do, if not, maybe we'll do it in the future, but we'll have to wait and see in a couple hours here. We still have about six hours until the new season comes out. Okay, back bling's pretty cool. This is the season they started doing the dual wield ones. 
So every season seems to have different different stuff to do. Like one year the pets, and then that dual wield um, harvestal tools now. It's pretty cool. But we're on the back wings now. Let's see. So we have this one. Some of these things I can't tell you where they came from. I know this one came from the Ice King. This one came from the the pirate, the skull pirate I showed you. It's from the prisoner. Some some I don't remember where they came from, and I don't often buy back blings or anything. Um, yeah, but so pretty cool. Like this is one of the pet ones. They're pretty cool. I use them sometimes. I it, it just depends on what the what skin I use and what back bling I match up with them. Like this one matches with this one pretty well. This one was the couple of skins, the ice skins, no boring one. It just, it just really depends. This is a pretty cool one. But yeah, it just depends. This, this is my favorite one for a while. But yeah, these are all just depend on what the skin is and what and how I want to match things up. This is from this season. This is from Will Kevin. This is during the um the cube event. Pretty cool stuff. Yeah, something I remember like this is from the Star Pack. Some things I remember where I got it from, and some things I cannot remember at all. This is from the new one I got. The Breaking Point one, that's that back bling. Pretty cool. I might actually put this one when I use a Skull Trooper. That kind of matches pretty well, too. So that's pretty cool. Okay, Harvesting Tool, like I said, this is one the first year they did the um, the dual one. So that's pretty cool. Interesting to see what Season 10 brings, which we'll find out soon. So I'm really looking forward to it, guys. Let me know, guys. Comment if you guys are excited for Season 10. And what do you predict is going to be? Do we only have a couple hours left? So here are some of my, my harvesting tools. Pretty cool. I love it. This is my one of my favorite ones. Like I said, this one also depends on what my skin what skin I use. Like for the banana, I would use this one. DJ Yonder, use this one. And then for any of the snow ones, I'd probably use this one. This is, this is my favorite one. I got this the very first time it came out. Absolutely love that one. And then you got the default one. Pretty cool. Now we're on the gliders. Like I said, I started um, buying battle passes in season five, so I have all those. Which season five? I season five and six. I don't think I got all the tier one hundred. Season eight, eight, nine. No, season seven, eight, nine. I got got to tier one hundred. So there's some things I missed, but oh well. It is what it is. Like this one I used for Halloween on like this Skull Trooper or whatever other Halloween skins are. Okay, like these also depend on what what skin I use. So, it's pretty cool stuff. This is another cool one too. I like this one. But my favorites are the when you get the wind, you get the bow for the, for the season. You get the um, glider. Pretty cool stuff. Something that I don't really use too much. This one is extreme. When you land, this one gives you away. This, this one is so loud when you land. You got some of the normal gliders. Downshift. I don't really use any of these too often. I mostly use the season that you went on to get the victory umbrella. Okay, here are my favorite ones here. Season 5, victory umbrella. Then this one's from season 4. Season 6, victory umbrella. The OG one for when you start the game. Season 7, the coolest snowman. And then season 3. And then season eight, this is, I love this one. And these next two, these two are my favorite ones right here. Sally, during season two is when I started. I started in season two. Sally, I did not get a victory royale in that one. Didn't get the snow one. But I got my first one, I think, at the beginning of season three. So, missed out on that, but oh well, it is what it is. But like I said, I didn't think Fortnite was going to blow up the way it did. I thought Fortnite was going to be like Roblox and Rocket League only last like a year or so. So, I didn't really, didn't think it was gonna, Fortnite was going to be the way it is. But it's pretty cool. Definitely a very fun game. But yeah, it's like this one I used was um the Peely skin. This one for Halloween. St. Patrick's Day. It just, just depends on the skin again. I like to match mine. This is one I've been using. Fiber Optics, I've been using that one a lot. This is another one I use a lot too. Yeah, some of it just depends on the, the skin. I just want to use the prisoner skin. Like I, I like to match my skins. But if you can customize, like I've been saying, if you can customize your skin and mismatch things around, that's be really, really cool. But you're not, I'm gonna probably end up with some ugly skins. But you're gonna have like millions of different ways to customize your, your um, I guess your avatar, I guess you could say, whatever your person on here. If you can mix match skins around, they're really cool. This one I use for like the snow ones. 
Like I said, yeah. So these ones I just depend on the season. This is another cool one too. Swirls and vibrant. These are from the season. There's a lot of really cool ones here. Okay, getting into the emotes now. It's always a lot of fun. I do, I do buy some, and some are from the Battle Pass. Like you'll see, I bought all, all, bought all the dab, the dab ones. So we got the frisbee, the fancy tomato. You guys have probably seen this door in my live streams. Me using a bunch of these. Pretty cool. But a bunch of these are from just the battle pass. Some I bought. Yeah, I'll let you guys know the ones I bought. Pretty cool stuff. This is in the season. Basketball from a couple seasons ago. This season during the summer event. Dad bought that one. Conga from last season. I love that. I love that email. Very cool. This season. A couple seasons ago, because it came with a Linux set. Don't know what season exactly this one came from. It was a cool one. Not exactly sure what season this game came from. Fancy Burger. Yeah, some I don't really know. Flying Disc. Funky. Golf. I think season 5 ish. I think season 5. I think the Toy Story came out season 5 ish. I think it was. Five or six. Mic drop. I don't know if I bought this one. No, I don't think I bought this one. I think that was part of a battle pass. Cool. Way back shuffle. Keep mellow. I think I got that one during the. Uh, during the event. During the marshmallow thingy. Event was going on. This one from this season. Pretty cool. This is a, this is a funny one. Uh, I do like this, this is an interesting thing though. Infant Dab, bought that one, definitely had to buy that one. Football, point out. This one's awkward when you have the dual one, it kind of looks funny. Surprised they haven't fixed it. Rain Man, that's a cool one. Tad Trombone, I do like this one too. Yeah, there's a lot of cool ones. But I miss like the season two and up. I missed a lot of the good ones, the OG ones, like the floss and stuff. It's a bummer, but oh well. Volcano. This kind of hand towards the volcano event last season. So that's pretty, pretty cool. If you guys look in the battle pad, it sometimes does hint what's gonna happen. Bag of cool, baited. It's pretty cool. The bush. I used to love the bush, and that was just kind of stupid. It's hard to see. This one I think is from season two. I think I think this was a season two one emote, or um, what's it called? Bit um, not an emote, whatever it's called. I do remember seeing that one. And you got the birthday one. Battle bus. Yeah, there's a lot of cool ones here. Press F. Everyone, everyone spam F in chat. We've heard that one many many times. First birth for Fortnite's first birthday. GG. Up here is Fort Leaf Clover for St. Patrick's Day. Use that one a lot. Gentleman's dab. This is part of the battle pass one. Hello friend, this is a cool one. Use that one sometimes. There's some I forgot I had because I don't use them too much. I don't remember where I got. I think I'm, yep, I bought this one. This is another one I bought. There's some the seasons always come together. This one I got, you got gifted to me. You don't get to somebody, so people get to me. Right, these two. The event. This was during a Christmas event or Christmas stuff going on. Let's take the different version, take the L. Fortnite second birthday. Yeah, there's some here I don't know. If you guys see any super rare ones, let me know. I don't know if anything's rare or not. This is a kind of this is a funny one too. Waving and the crying one. Pretty pretty funny stuff. And then this one came out last season, different wraps. Pretty cool. These are I think I've bought maybe one of them. I don't remember which one I bought. 
But if it's really cool, I'd buy it. But I don't buy them too often. Because we would get a lot of cool ones in the Battle Pass. So, I'm looking forward to the AI new. New scenes. They, they always add something brand new. Like nothing like shotgun, shotgun gun wraps and stuff. These are all kind of still new to the game. And then you just started putting them in the shop too. Peely. Well, he's a Peely skin. I wish he's this one too. So, birthday one. Like I said, I'm interested to see what they bring out. This is a cool one too. The pineapple. Really, really neat one. And then banners. Oops. Some cool ones here. Like I said, I do got some some original ones from season two when I first started. So I do got some of those. So kind of cool, cool stuff. Different music. They started adding this a couple seasons ago too. And then here's some loading screens I have. I don't really don't really care too much about the loading screens. It is what it is. But yeah, some are pretty cool. And I'm definitely looking forward to season 10 happening in a couple hours here. Oh, look at this one. Sorry about it. They're kind of hitting towards Dusty Divot coming back earlier in the season. So it was right under our noses the whole time. So I'm looking forward to that coming back and just seeing their map changes tomorrow and just everything new. I think they're going to be adding, because the volcano's still there. It's going to be, it's kind of hard to explain, but um, parts of the map are going to be from different seasons. I think it is because of volcano. But it's pretty much going to be the map if the meteor didn't hit. Because the volcano will still happen once the prisoner caused that. Um, I don't know. We're going to wait and see. We could be wrong. But we have a couple hours left, guys, until the new season. We have, what, three hours? Uh, I'm recording right now. We have three hours and 37 minutes until season 10, guys. So we'll see. Um, this will be crazy. They're bringing back Dusty Dusty Depot. That's going to be crazy. I do miss. And I am going to miss D Dusty Divot. Good times there, and I'm gonna miss the party. I think they're gonna get rid of the the, the um, desert biome buy buy too, or change up a little bit. Um, I don't know. There'll be a lot of changes. We'll see what happens to the tilt towers. I don't know. We'll see, or neon tilt, I should say. Like I said, I was all, I was an all right fan of this season. It was all right. I've seen better seasons. I just don't like futuristic. That's why I wasn't a big fan of Call of Duty when they started getting real f futuristic. So. Well, we'll find out in a couple hours here what happens. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys for watching. And like I said, I'll probably do one of these locker videos um, in November when Season 10 comes out. Or Season 11 comes out. So, guys, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I will see you guys later.